up you guys? You got Esmeralda here coming at you guys with something new. And I know last week I did not post a video because obviously most of my videos when I record on my phone, they either glitch or they're just totally screwed up. So basically this t video was totally screwed up and I didn't think it was a good video. Um, this Friday I was supposed to post a video with my little sister, um, the flip, sip, or slip challenge. It's basically a really fun game where you just flip the bottle, either you drink the disgusting drink that's in it, or you confess something that the person asked you. Obviously when I was editing that video earlier, that video glitched and it totally just was totally destroyed. But now I'm here with this video, which I hope you guys enjoy, which is another boy problem video. And um, obviously some of you guys actually like these videos. I really like making them for you guys. It's really fun. It's really entertaining. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get started in 3, 2, 1. <coughs> So this had recently just happened this whole week. Um, the only reason why I'm not going to be posting my videos uh, as much as often because obviously I have, if you guys follow me on my social medias, which are right here, my Snapchat, my Twitter, my Instagram, and my you now, obviously. Um, obviously on Snapchat, you guys saw me post a video or if you guys follow me on Snapchat, which you guys should, just saying, I take... College classes. No, I'm not in college. I'm still in high school, but during the summer, I go and take college classes. This is my first year, because last year, I had to take summer school for extra credit. But this year, I'm taking college classes, and I'm telling you right now, it's a lot of hard work, not gonna lie. I was excited for college. I still am, don't get me wrong, but it's a lot of hard work. Like, it's a lot. Anyway, if you guys follow me on that, yeah. Um, that's the only reason why most of my videos will be uploaded late, because I will be busy trying to do a bunch of other stuff you know <clears throat> so um besides that the point of that i just wanted to get that aside let me continue um so in this video obviously i will not be revealing no names or any social medias this is just going to be a made-up name and we will today name this person f boy as in you know fuck boy um the other reason why i do not have anything nice to say about this guy is because in the past i'm little backstory he did screw a lot with a lot of girls. He always jumped from girl to girl to girl. Um, he would always say stuff that you are never supposed to tell a girl. And basically, like, checking out their body. Like, yeah, I get it. Some guys check out the body. But this guy just takes it a little bit overboard. So this is why we're naming him F-Boy. Anyway, so this week, I obviously go to college. This happened on a Tuesday. Um, on Tuesday morning, this guy... F-boy texted me saying, hey, he was waving at me, and I waved back, because I'm, I'm not a mean person. I, I really am not. All right, sorry. I had to go say hi to family members real quick. But <clears throat> recently, on Tuesday, F-boy basically, you know, texted me. He, you know how on Messenger they have, like, the little wave thing? Well, I waved back. He, he was waving at me. I waved back, because I'm not a mean person. I really am not. I'm like... I'm not kind of people that will give you several chances and end up forgiving you, but if you push my limit, then yeah. Anyway... Um, so he waved at me and he's like, what are you doing? And I was like, I'm going to school. And when I mean that, I mean I'm going to my college. And he's all like, isn't school over? Obviously, because we're in summer. And I was like, oh, I go to um, a certain program, which I, I can't name because I think it's like a lot of information given. But I go to a certain program that takes high school students. Sorry, my uh, phone decided, I mean, yeah, my phone decided to cut off because it didn't have enough memory. So I had to, you know, fix it. Anyway, so it's saying, basically this program can accept all the grade levels except when you're a senior, you can't be in the summer programs. For example, the seniors that just graduated this year, they can't be a part of the college thing because obviously now they actually have to go to college. Um, anyway, back to the story. He texted me and I was just like, oh, okay, I, um, anyway. So yeah, I will not be putting the text in this thing because first of all, you guys will get hella mad. Second of all, I just don't want to. Even though, like, it's, it's just going to be a story time. I can't show the messages. <clears throat> anyway, so F-Boy texted me. He's like, isn't school over? And I was just like, I go to the program. He's like, oh, cool. And then out of nowhere, he says, I was like, okay. And out of nowhere, he says, I liked your Instagram post. I, if you guys follow me on Instagram again, you guys can see that I post pictures of me, of, like, pictures I've took in. Uh, because I want to be a photographer when I, like, graduate or study cosmetology and other stuff. But still, I know. Um, YouTube is not going anywhere. YouTube is still going to be a big part of my life. So, yeah. 
he started telling me he's like i like to post and i was like yeah okay thanks you know like it was getting awkward because i have not talked to this guy since last year and it was kind of getting weird like don't get me wrong it was getting weird and i'm a really nice person so i was sugarcoating things and trying to keep the conversation short um he started telling me that my makeup was on fleek that i looked really pretty and stuff like that and i was just like oh thanks you know out of nowhere he says the he says i wanna cuddle with you random i know lol i just i'm like um i don't know what it's from so i'm like I was like, uh, okay. He's, I'm like, he, like, it just weirded me out. And I was like, why? I texted back, why? And then he's all like, he's all like, because your body shape is perfect, perfect for cuddling, and you're really pretty. Your body is cuddable. Like, I'll, I'll put the word right here. This is the word he said. This is exactly how he spelled it. And I responded with, Cuddleable? Like, it sounds like cutting, but no, it's cuddle, like cuddling. He's like, yeah, I can see you and me cuddling, big spoon or small spoon. <laughs> Bitch, what? So I got weirded out. I was just like, um, okay. And then he's all like, I'm okay, why? And I was like, I don't know. It's like, because I didn't know what to respond to. Like, this thing was creeping me out. Like, he was creeping me out. F-boy was creeping me out and then after that he's like would you cuddle with me and i was like i hit his ass with a straight up no he's all like why and i was like why would i once again i'm i'm too busy to be focusing on boys first of all i don't like this guy second of all he's really weird and just makes me mad most of the time third of all i was trying to be nice but he got weird it got really weird <sighs> so he's like why i was like why would i and he's all like like, come on, give me a chance and all this other bullcrap. And I was just like, no. And he's like, I was like, he's like, come on, cuddle with me. And I was like, no. He's like, why? And I was like, because no. And he's all like, come on. And I was just like, no, like, I'm not going to. Like, no, don't you understand the word no? And then, and then he's all like, he's like, because I'm actually falling for you. He texted me because I'm actually falling for you now. Keep in mind. Little, before I continue with the story, little backstory. Before, I used to have him on Snapchat, and he texted me, hey, and I was like, hey, and then he texted me, you thick AF. First of all, you never start a conversation with me like that, ever. I hate it. That's such an F-boy thing to do, and this is exactly why we're calling him F-boy. I don't like it, first of all. Don't ever, like, stare at my body like that. That means you're just after my body and you don't accept me for my personality and everything like that. So I was just like, no. Like, don't ever start like that. And I blocked him. After that, you know, a while passed and this happened. And then he's like, come on, give me a chance. I was just like, no. And then when he said, I'm actually falling for you, I'm like, yeah, okay, yeah, right. Bye now. He's like, dude, you have to believe me. He's all like, Esme. And then I just left him on read. And then he sent me a bunch of question marks. And then I was like, F boy, stop. And he's like, why? I'm like, because I don't believe you. And it's too early for this. It was 7 a.m., guys. It was 7 a.m., me going to school. And it was 7 a.m. and he was bothering me this early. And then after that, he's like, come on, you have to believe me. And I was just like, I don't. We all know you like jumping from girl to girl to girl to girl. And he's like, no, I don't. I actually want a relationship. And I was just like, I don't believe you. First of all, guys, I don't have time for guys. I'm too busy. School, study, YouTube, body. I'm working on my body and I'm working on myself. I don't have time for guys. Maybe in the future, but not now. Then after that, he's like, come on, like, give me a chance. And I was like, no, no. And then after that, he wouldn't leave me alone. He's all like, I'll do anything TBH to prove to you. And then he says, bro, WTF, I'm not lying. And I was like, bro, really, bro? That's where you mess up, bro? Really? 
after that, he's, I'm like, no, leave me alone. He's like, how can I prove it to you? I responded with exactly these words. You can prove it to me by leaving me alone. He then sends me, okay, with a broken heart and a crying face. I've done like, okay, that's over with. He's not going to bother me anymore. <sighs> Was I wrong thinking that he wasn't going to bother me anymore? Later on, I come home from school. Later on, I come home from school. I'm finally here resting, and I'm telling my mom the whole situation. My brother, I trust him. I'm telling him about the situation, too. And he's like, just ignore him. And I was like, yeah, cool. I rejected him either way. Later on that day, he texted, hey, and I was like, what? Like, I, I know I sound mean, but let me tell you, this guy was taking me off, and he's just another fuckboy. Like, you can't expect me to, you know, believe. I literally told him that he was full of BS. So I got upset. I was just like, what does he want now? He's like, what are you doing, cutie? And I was just like, don't call me that. Once again, like, I'm showing signs that I'm not interested. I don't like him. He was really annoying me and really making me mad. After that, he's like, sorry. He's like, but what are you doing now? And I was like, home. Like, I was being so dry with him. And then he wouldn't get the hand. And then he's all like, well, what are you doing there? And I was like, what do you want? He's like, I want you. And I was just like, oh my God. I looked at the text and I literally laughed because I knew he was lying. He was just after my body, which sucks to, to hear because a lot of guys are doing that now. Not, a, not all of you, but most of the guys from my high school are. So, sorry. So then I was just like, no, I was just like, leave me alone. He's all like, come on, give me a chance, give me a chance. I'll treat you, I'll be gentle and I'll treat you like a queen. I lied to him, saying I was taken. And by the way, I have a friend who is willing to pretend to be my boyfriend. I have a friend who is willing to pretend to be my boyfriend just to help me get rid of an F boy. Like, he's honestly the best. He already, you know who you are. If you're watching this video, you know exactly who you are. But, yeah, I told him, he's like, I'll be gentle, I'll treat you right, I'll treat you like a queen. And I was like, I already have someone that treats me like a queen besides myself. After that, he's all like, who? And I was like, someone. He's like, who? For reals, though. And I was like, someone. I'm taken, leave me alone. After that, he didn't text me back. And that was good because after I told him about this situation, he was like, just block him. And I was like... Yes, that is exactly what I should do. Like, this problem will be over in less than five seconds if I just block him. After that, I blocked him on Instagram, Snapchat. Well, I've already blocked him on Snapchat before, so in the past I blocked him on Snapchat. And I blocked him on Messenger, and I'm so glad the situation is done. I don't want to ever hear from him again, no offense. But that's just another F-boy. That's why his name in here is F-boy. Anyways... I hope you guys enjoyed that video. I know it was like kind of like short-ish, kind of. But if you guys did, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell button for more future videos. And if you guys want to see what other videos I have in mind or I haven't planned, then definitely subscribe, please. Please. We're almost to 60 subscribers, guys. So, yes, hit that bell button. And once we hit 60 subscribers, I'll be doing a really cool hat of dares. I got the idea from the Dolan Twins, so shout out to the Dolan Twins who gave me the idea. Not literally, but I was watching their videos. I will be doing Hat of Dares, and if you guys want that to happen, you guys should leave me some dares in the comment section below. It doesn't matter if you're the same person and want to comment a thousand million times. You can, and go for it if you want. So yeah, hit that bell button and give this video a thumbs up. And I will see you guys next Friday with a new video. So yeah, subscribe. <laughs> I said that so much. But yeah, come on guys. We're almost 60 subscribers and I'm really excited. So yeah, we passed my goal. My goal was supposed to be first 50 subscribers and now we're almost to 60. Let's see if we can reach to 150. And also, uh, I got some other news. I'm going to be traveling in July. I'm going to LA, San Francisco, and Oklahoma. I will also be getting a new laptop and a new camera. So I won't have to be recording on my phone anymore and struggling anymore. I will actually edit good content. So yeah, 
I love you guys very, very much, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Stay weird, weirdos. <laughs>